Uh, hello there, guys. So, today I am going to be comparing Spider-Man Turn Off the Dark 1.0 with 2.0. Now, I have only seen 2.0. I have not seen 1.0. I know exactly what happens. I've read detailed descriptions on the internet, uh, and I'd really like to see, like, a bootlegged version of it, like, online or something. Um, but if you have, if you filmed it or anything, I'm not going to buy anything because that's against the law. I'm not going to do anything illegal, but, um, if you have it, could you please, uh, email it to me? That would be great. Uh, 1.0. Now, uh, I just want to do that so I can compare it. Now, some people prefer 1.0. 1.0 actually got some of the worst reviews in Broadway history, but it still had its hardcore fans who thought it was great and Spider-Man 2.0 was terrible. Now, I've only seen 2.0. I thought it was great, but who knows. Um, but I'm going to be comparing the plot. Uh, but here's what the plot for 1.0 is. Uh, there's a group of geeks uh, called the Geek Chorus and they're writing a Spider-Man fan fiction. And what happens is the first act... Um, we're introduced to Peter Parker, blah, 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 he's in high school, he has a crush on Mary Jane, um, who's a student there, and blah, 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 and, you know, everything of that nature. But, uh, after that, Peter, um, <clears throat> gets bitten by the spider, gets his, uh, powers, and becomes Spider-Man, but, um, <clears throat> and then also he... Uh, Norman Osborn, he looks up to Norman Osborn, and he meets Norman Osborn, and he gets bitten in the lab, but he gets bitten by this Greek character named uh, Arachne, and obviously, uh, blah, 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 Uncle Ben dies and everything. And then uh, afterwards, after Uncle Ben dies, Arachne convinces uh, Spider-Man, well, Peter, to become a superhero, and he becomes Spider-Man. And so... Then, uh, Norman Osborn realizes that, uh, this is, that Spider-Man was his work. It was created by him. So he decides, so he thinks that some other company is trying to rival with him. Um, so he takes a goblin serum and becomes the green goblin. And so, he, he realizes Peter is Spider-Man, because Peter was the only one that was bitten by the spider. So, they, so he kidnaps Mary Jane, Spider-Man finds him on top of the Chrysler building, and uh, they fight above the audience. Like, no kidding, they do. And um, Green Goblin dies, Mary Jane is rescued, and that's the end of Act 1. Act 2 is, um, well, the geek chorus thinks, okay, well, the story's over, uh, because Spider-Man's defeated the Goblin, the Goblin is his greatest enemy, um, but then another geek is like, nope, that's not the end of the story, so they keep writing some more, and they write in some more villains, uh, which is the Sinister Six, but this time the Sinister Six is Carnage, Swarm, uh, the Lizard, um, trying to, oh, Swiss Miss, who's a new character, um, there were two others, uh, I'm trying to think, oh yeah, Electro and Craven. so those are, that's the Sinister Six in this play, and, uh, Spider-Man easily defeats the Six, and so, it's like, yay, Spider-Man won, um, so, Spider-Man defeats the Sinister Six, and, uh, but then he has some troubles with Mary Jane. He has some relationship problems with MJ, and so because of these relationship problems that he's having, he decides to quit being Spider-Man. He says, I'm Spider-Man no more, and he gives his costume over to J. Jonah Jameson, and, you know, he quits and everything. And Arachne actually wants Peter, I believe she wants him to join him 
in the type of... Because Arachne is stuck. Used to be human, and she tried to commit suicide because she law, because Athena uh, had done something to her. But Athena felt bad, and so she, exi- so she decided to turn her into a spider, and Arachne hated that. So um, she wants Peter to join her in this limbo of hers, and he can't do that if he's not Spider-Man. <clears throat> so they, so she tries to create illusions of the Green Goblin and the Sinister Six, um, and she makes an illusion of them basically wrecking havoc upon the entire world, and that doesn't. But P- and Peter still doesn't want to be Spider-Man again after that, and he doesn't realize Arachne is doing this. So then Arachne, get this, Arachne steals shoes. Um, yeah. <laughs>